my dog collection. And it has 12 dogs. So today I'll show you what are, where are all those dogs behind. Here, you see? Okay, match them, Mahika. So, you tell me which one I can put. Okay, can you show me where's the German Shepherd? German Shepherd, okay. That one. And this one is the biggest dog of all. Let's see. What is? What does it say about German Shepherd? It, it says, says that it's the height is 22 to 26 inches and it can weigh yeah. up to 77 and 85 pounds. Yeah. It's added a seeing eye dog. Oh yeah, that's correct. Police dogs, watchdogs, and family companions. Wow. This breed began as farm dogs. Intelligent, noble, and confident. German Shepherds also have a sweet and loyal disposition. Strong and tall, this breed has pointed ears, a broad chest, and almond-shaped eyes. German Shepherds can be black, tan, silver, red, cream, or a combination. Show and them again. This is who, this is the one, and it very, and it weighs until seventy, eighty hit. Okay, it says pounds. Next dog. Now, Mahika, can you find me the Chihuahua? Chihuahua. Okay, Chihuahua. Let's see. Are you sure it's a Chihuahua? Yeah. What's its color? It's. It's kind of, it's kind of peach, but this is showing a different color. And this is a bit light. And is it a small or big dog? A small dog. Let's find out what this says about Chihuahua. Wow. Chihuahua. Not everyone agrees on the history of this popular petite breed. Did it originate with the Aztecs in Mexico or among the ancient Egyptians or in the Sudan? Wherever it came from, originally this is a little dog with a big personality. Chihuahuas are alert and confident with plenty of attitude. They come in long and smooth cove varieties. Colors include black, chocolate, red, gold, tan, and white. And it's also white a bit here. Run it up here. Let's land it up like this. Landed up like this, or we can put it on top, but this is a better side. Okay, next one. Can you find me the Saint Bernard? Saint Bernard, let's find this. Saint Bernard, okay, which one is Saint Bernard? Looks like this. Find me the dog that looks like that. Oh, okay, I don't know which one. Is it this one? Oh, correct. And I almost forgot what is this dog, so that's why. What it says about Saint Bernard? It says, first bred by Alpine monks in the 11th century, Saint Bernards became famous for their abilities as rescue dogs. Their modern descendants are still powerful and muscular. Their intelligent eyes and friendly expression make them a popular breed among dog lovers of all ages. And this is the next biggest dog of all. What else did it say? St. Bernard's have a wide and wrinkly face, short muzzle, heavy tail, and dense fur that usually combines white and red. What's next? And Let this is the, also the next biggest dog we have. So let's put it near the other next big. Okay, I'm oh, ready. Next is the Pomeranian. Oh, the Pomeranian. Find the Pomeranian. Okay, Mom. Pomeranian. Let's. You're correct. You know, Pomeranians usually are 7 to 12 inches in height and will weigh around 3 to 7 pounds. 
Though Pomeranians descended from Nordic sled dogs, they became a popular companion dog when bred down to toy size. Outgoing, curious, and spirited, Pomeranians have small, perky ears, a prompt tail, and a rough of fur around their heads and necks. Intelligence and, and liveliness make and them excellent Mama, therapy stop, dogs, stop, stop. and they can be Mama, black, can red, cream, white, or a combination. Do you know that? And everywhere is spiky of this dog. Next time you can touch one of these dogs. Okay. And it's kind of hard. Okay. Spiky. Good job. We have how many dogs so far? Four. Okay. Now let's look for the Cocker Spaniel. Cocker Spaniel? Where is that Cocker Spaniel? That's us. Cocker Spaniel. Okay, Cocker Spaniel. Does it look like that? Yeah, it almost looks the same. Okay, I think it's a medium-sized dog. Yeah, it's a What does it say about Cocker Spaniel? It says, Originally bred in the United Kingdom as hunting dogs, Cocker Spaniels have a memorably silky, short coat, long, soft ears, and a sweet, gentle personality. Yeah! An intelligent expression and affectionate nature make this small sporting dog... First. An excellent and choice a very as nice a companion animal. Ever. Cheerful and playful, Cocker Spaniels yeah. can come in lots of colors from solid black, red, yeah. brown, and golden to multicolored. Then you look. And next, and this is uh, one of the softest dogs. And I don't want it to get rough. So I'm keeping it near the first dog. And second dog is this one. Third dog is a very spiky dog, but you have to keep it a one meter distance. One meter distance because of? It's spiky. And I don't want it to become also these two spikies. Let's go. What's next? Let's find a Dalmatian. Okay, a Dalmatian. Here! What can you say about the Dalmatian? It and the Dalmatians have some spot. spots. And my little baby sister just ate it a bit. Let's see what it says about the po this polka dot dog. Dalmatians, with their polka dotted coats and tradition as firehouse dogs, Dalmatians' history goes back centuries. Their origin is often attributed to a region in Croatia called Dalmatia. Loyal, devoted, and smart, their sleek and athletic build lets them run fast. And for a considerable length of time, Dalmatian puppies mm -hmm. are completely white at birth. Black or brown spots only appear after a few weeks. Do you understand that? Mama, I'm going to press the video this. What's next? Let's find the Labrador Retriever. Oh, a Labrador Retriever? That... Is it this one? Correct. Yeah. Let's see what it says about Labrador Retrievers. Labrador Retrievers started off as hunting dogs, so it's no surprise that they're excellent runners and swimmers. They even have a resistant coat of fur mm. and other tail. Labrador Retrievers are outgoing, kind, and deeply attached Mama, to their humans. Mama, Mama. They make excellent assistance Mama, dogs Mama. and are ranked Mama, as most popular Mama, breed Mama. in the U.S. And can they can be black, Spanish chocolate, or yellow. Yeah. No, line it up. Uh, Mom. Mama. Mama. Yes. And more of the... Okay, 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 okay. I want one more Spanish bread, please. How many dogs left before you have your Spanish bread? One, two, three, four. Let's see. Let's okay, see can you find the West Highland White Terrier? Wow. 
that one. It says developed in Scotland, West Highland White Terriers are small in stature but full of energy, affectionate and social with their people as well as other animals. Westies are also independent and confident. They love to play and require cons considerable exercise. In addition to their perky ears and tail, an all-white coat is distinctive feature of Westies. What is your color? White. Good job. Okay, now let's... There's four more. Yeah. Now let's find the Dashund. Dashund. Good job. Dashund. Let me read it. It's a German dog. Originally developed in Germany hundreds of years ago as a hunting dog, Dachshunds are instantly recognizable by their short stature and extra long bodies. The beloved companion animals, Dachshunds, are smart and animated. Their coat can be smooth, wire-haired, or long-haired, and colors include red, cream, black, Chocolate and gray, both chocolate. solid and in stripes of pattern. Chocolate, that's gray? Yeah. I love chocolate. Okay. Yeah. Light them up. Okay. Do, 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 do. It's the first, next. Now, another one meter. And from the two spiky dogs. Okay, now. there's three more. Oh, Let's yeah. find the husky. Husky. Okay, where yeah, is husky? Oh. Husky, 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 husky. Husky, this one. This? Okay. Oh, that's an Akita. Find a husky first. Oh, uh, whoops. Husky, okay. Let's see. Correct. Husky. Originally had for sledding. This friendly, intelligent dog loves to roam. Huskies have curved. Bush, bushy tails, erect ears, and a double coat of fur. Their eyes can be brown, blue, or both, and each eye has a different color. Eager to please, huskies get along with, with other dogs and most people, especially children, but may not play nicely with smaller animals. Huskies often boast of striking colors and patterns. Whoops! The last two dogs. Okay, let's keep the biggest dog next to the more biggest dogs. Oops. Let's find the Akira. Akira? Akita. Akita. It's a Japanese dog. Yeah. Akira, Desig designated a national monument in their native Japan, Akiras were first bred as hunting dogs. Wow. Brave, dignified, and profoundly loyal to their human families, Akiras are also stubborn and may not be comfortable with strangers or other animals. They have a large, powerful build, a curved tail, perky ears, and a thick double coat which can be brown, fawn, red, silver, or a combination. Oh, last one. Next. And lastly, what is that? French Bulldog! Good job. Let's find out more about French Bulldog. French Bulldogs have a charming history. In the 19th century, British lace makers bred them as lap dogs. When their owners moved across the channel, the pups took Paris by storm. Mischievous and frisky, French Bulldogs are brown for their short, smooth coat. Yeah! Bat ears can and you, bubbly can personality, I hold it? Can I hold it, including Mama? cream, black, and brindle with I'll light hold on and dark me. streaks. Now it's time to put the dog in their houses. Yeah. And do you remember what I showed you that Chihuahua is the smallest and cutest dog, and it goes with this and a dog house. But it's just next, stay. first Akira. Okay, Akira, Akira, Akira. Akira is the Japanese dog. Uh, Japanese. Put them in the medium ones. 
Medium. Yeah, just put everything inside. Okay. My husky dog is here. And this one here. And your little crunch. Little dog and your little cute one. And your next one. This next one is the big dog. But this is the biggest. All these biggest. But this is, has to be a medium. Medium one. But actually it can fit. And let's put the, this here. And this one here. Or maybe this is a bit small so it can go here. This. Good All job. Done. All done. Push, push, push. Say see you next time. See you next time. Bye.